Hello! <laughs> my name is Sydney, and uh, yes, it's been, there's a thing on my screen right there. Uh, it's been quite a while since I've done any sort of vlogging. I hope you can hear me, because it's sort of windy here. But uh, today I am in Dungeness, which is a peninsula on the southern coast of Kent in England. And it's, as you can see, the landscape is very barren, and that's what attracts people here. Also, there are like various buildings that are very sparsely placed, and they all have like their unique uh, sort of character. Like this one, although this one's sort of full of jungle for some reason. It's just a very strange location. There's also like a lighthouse over there. There's two lighthouses actually, I'm not too sure where the other one's gone. Where's the other one? Oh, there. There's one right there, and there's one there. And one other thing that is at Dungeness is that there's actually a nuclear power station, which is that big thing. But don't worry, I'm not being irradiated right now, because it was closed down like 10 years ago or something, or five years ago, I'm not too sure. So basically it's no longer in use. And it's like uh, gonna take a hundred years for them to knock it down or something, but that's not why people come here They come here for like the landscape, which is quite unique for the UK to have like such a wide open expanse of just flatness and or well, grass and mixture of pebbles as well And it goes on for miles, literally miles and miles like that way all over everywhere <laughs> So I, I should also uh, put like a map to show you, and I'm just gonna like film various things that I see. Righty-o, I hope you can hear me over the waves. Oh, wow. Uh, <laughs> wow, this is quite exciting. Uh, so yeah, I just made my way down from up there where we, we parked the car on like a road that leads towards the peninsula. We're not at the peninsula yet. We're close though, because I, we, you could see like half of the stuff that was on near the end of Dungeness Peninsula. But I just thought I'd walk down to the sea and you can actually see France in the distance, but this camera won't pick it up for some reason. It's like a uh, very faint, it's like just little, um, almost transparent little bumps on the horizon, so you can barely see it, unfortunately. <laughs> but I really like it here, it's very unique. And look at this nice little tractor just hanging out here. Lots of strange stuff hanging out. We should be heading towards the, uh, the end soon, so I shall definitely make sure to capture that. Also, I forgot to say, you can see the White Cliffs of Dover from here. See? Right there. Quite prominent on the horizon. Okay, so we're getting closer to the lighthouse. We've walked along the beach for quite a while, uh, me and the people who I'm with, and uh, it got quite exhausting. I'm now on like a pebble road, which isn't so like your feet sink into the ground, and then you have to like keep going blush and blush and blush, which gets kind of uh, tiring. But it's very interesting. Like I, I said already, but there's so much stuff just randomly placed and like decaying, or you wonder why it's here. And it's just so flat as well. Like most of England is sort of hilly sort of small hills. It's not normally as flat as this. It's uh, oh wow. There's even a catamaran right there. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, there's a lighthouse. Uh, uh, which one is it? I can't tell because it's sort of dark and I can't really see. It might both of them might be a Oh no, no. It's uh, that one. That's the first lighthouse and the second lighthouse is there. And then there's the power station. And I believe this first lighthouse is the closest to the actual point, the peninsula. But the peninsula in Dungeness is all rounded, so there's not really an actual point that it goes to. I 
feel like I'm in a horror film. Any moment now, some scary monster will come out of one of these holes or from around and I'll run to safety, hide inside one of the lockers until I'm saved by whoever saves the day. One of the main sights at Dungeness is the, uh, the steam railway that they have there. And here is a shot of the uh, the terminal. Uh, here you can see the Dungeness sign! And now we have a shot of the, uh, the steam railway coming into the station. And uh, I believe it goes all the way from the settlement of Hive uh, up the coast, if anyone knows about that. And it travels through quite a few places in the marsh that surrounds Dungeness, which is called uh, Romley Marsh. Uh, I'll just let you have a look at this lovely shot of it steering itself into the uh, terminal. There's also a uh, a cafe at um the railway terminal called the Light Railway Cafe. And I had a donut, as you can see right there, and a vanilla Yazoo milkshake. They were okay, I guess, but there is another restaurant which is called the, the Britannia, and I recommend that one more. Okie dokie, so the last thing I'm doing today at Dungeness, I'm not actually going to go to the very end because uh, people are tired, I'm not, but it's uh, been kind of a long day. It took us, a uh, we got here at like midday and now it's um, almost the end of the afternoon. So uh, I'm going, the last thing I'm going to do is go up the old lighthouse. Oh wow, that's a good angle of me because the sun isn't making the thing overexposed. Yay! No, probably awful face I did right there. Hello. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm just embarrassing myself. Something I realised is that uh, Dungeness isn't too far with the, from the border of Kent and Sussex, so I'm nearly in another county here, actually. Uh, for anyone who didn't know, I live in Kent. <laughs> I think we're nearly at the top of the tower now. Or maybe not, there might be a few more levels. Oh look, a door. This is a uh, room closed for something or other repairs, thank you. They have blocked it out so I can't tell what's in there. Oh, this window has a bit of condensation light. <laughs> Let's keep going. Ah, don't run out of breath, Sydney. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That must be the top there. We've got a few more floors to go. You know, actually, this tower seems to be getting taller. Well, lighthouse seems to be all blurry. Blurry all of a sudden. Focus. There we go. Uh, this tower seems to be getting taller and taller every time I look. Because, like, I think there might be even more stairs beyond that bit. Hey, hey, I'm just going to film when I get to the top.
blimey. I am now at the top of the lighthouse. <laughs> and my, the view's amazing up here. You can see for miles. Oh, like in the distance over there. Sort of like cliffs of Dover. Um, there's the railway track that goes, uh, I think goes this way, all the way to Hythe in the distance, like over there somewhere. There's the power plant, and I think, yes, if I am careful, beyond those power railings, you see where there's like a little bay? I think that that is Sussex, like probably all Sussex over there. There's the new lighthouse, and maybe I can get it on the camera this time. But I think you can see France just about there. It's very, very faint, but you can actually see it. Okay, so if I sounded really like worried throughout the whole recording, it's the first time I've really done a recording. Uh, the light's probably terrible there. The first time I've done like a recording where there are like loads of people up here. There aren't really any people here anymore, but that's why I was sort of kind of quivering a little bit. But blimey, it's just fantastic up here. I'm so excited. Like, yay! <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh, the camera wants to take a picture. Yay! Okay, it's done. That's probably really awkward. I'm probably going to cut that out. <laughs> and I probably look terrible. I'm not good with photos. When I try to, like, take photos, I don't know how to express my, like, my mouth. Like, should I go, hey? Or should I go, hmm? It's just, like, really strange. I can't really get it to work. But why am I talking about this up here? I'm on top of a lighthouse at Dungeness, at the, 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 the very end of Dungeness. Oh, it's just, you can see forever, you can see France, even! This is incredible! I get really excited about things like this, and I think I have to go down now, because uh, I've got to walk back to the car, which is quite a way. I think at the end of this video, I'm going to put like a little map that shows how far I walked. It wasn't terribly far, but it's sort of what people typically do at Dungeness. Now to get back through this tiny hole to get inside the lighthouse. Come on. Yep. Oh gosh, I look terrible. Yeah. There we go. I'm inside, you can probably hear me much better. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please tell me what you think of this location, actually. Um, I just love filming when I go to interesting... I whacked the camera on the lighthouse just then. <laughs> when I go to interesting places, I like to hear what people think. But yeah. I hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Goodbye!